be here. Uh, I want to thank IBM for hosting this, this great event. We had a wonderful time yesterday, and we look forward to presenting to a, to a broader audience today. I want to thank the VC community also for the great turnout. So I'm the founder and CEO of CareCloud. CareCloud is an on-demand software and services company for the healthcare industry. Our name comes from a combination of healthcare and cloud computing. Cloud computing being, you know, base, uh, basically using computing as a utility. Um, our clients are really the medical practice. So it's ambulatory healthcare or everything south of the hospital, essentially. And um, who better to leverage a cloud computing model than a small business like a medical practice? So something I want to define before I move forward is the term ecosystem, the way we look at it. You know, we think of it as a community working together and dependent upon one another in order to thrive. But when you think of healthcare, you know, you really got, have the complete opposite on your hands. You have an island of isolation between the different constituent groups, whether that be the doctors, the insurance companies, the patients, there's distrust, and there's a lack of a common infrastructure. And if you look at most industries uh, in this country or in the world, you, you have common infrastructure, and that leads to efficiency and, and just better dynamics in the industry. But in healthcare, this is sorely lacking. When you think of a doctor's office, you know, one of the first pictures you, you, you visualize is, you know, these paper charts living on the doctor's wall, each one of them representing your medical records or a subset of your medical records because maybe if this doctor's office has two locations and you visited both, these medical records are spread out and therefore um, inadequate. When you think of their infrastructure, the way the doctor in one practice communicates with the doctor in another practice. <laughs> in 1983, they had a fax machine, and, and wow, that was a tremendous advancement for them. But today, you know, you have a bigger, better, multi-purpose uh, fax machine. But essentially, it's the fax machine and the telephone that they're using to communicate with each other. And we're talking about some pretty significant data requirements when you think about the complexity of healthcare information. Uh, being, you know, transferred from one practice to another in, in an analog form um, very inefficiently, you know, it's, it's a real problem. And when you look at their technology, unfortunately, what you have is 97% of the marketplace today is using client-server computing, uh, systems that were developed in the 1990s on 1990s architectures, uh, in, in essence, this industry is significantly lagging behind uh, the rest of the world. So we believe there's a better way. Uh, we believe that we, number one, need to elevate the infrastructure and the medical practice to the internet, leverage cloud computing. What better way to deliver technology into the practice than you know, a light technology footprint with little support requirements and just an internet connection. These, the average practice in this country is a million dollar revenue don't have the, the funds, the resources to have their own technology groups. They really are much better uh, depending upon a professional provider, whether that be for their software application, their infrastructure, their data, etc. Now, the 3% of, so of, of cloud-based software providers that I mentioned, they, they do a pretty good job of leveraging the internet as a channel to deliver their system to the end user. But none of them really do a very good job of using the ubiquity of the internet to connect everybody. And this is where CareCloud is very, very different. So we believe that our system not only be, needs to be delivered to doctors and their staff, but it needs to be delivered to patients, possibly even accountants, bankers, diagnostic centers, essentially anyone that participates in the healthcare ecosystem. And of course, doing that through the web. So at the foundation of our, of our platform, uh, we have something called CareCloud Community. And CareCloud Community operates uh, like a professional network, if you want to call it that, or a social network, if that's something that's better understood. But essentially, it's an invitation-driven type of system where the doctor can connect to their patients, and the doctor in one practice can connect to the doctor in another practice. So imagine, for instance, that a primary care provider is referring a patient over to a cardiologist, and they can just do that through you know, transferring their records through the ecosystem rather than uh, you know, having to recapture all this information through hand, handwritten forms and so forth in every practice. So we create this kind of network effect within the platform over time. 
We go to market with CareCloud Central, CareCloud Charts. These are software applications written on top of the platform. Very, very rich and modern applications. Introducing things, you know, basic things that we're all used to, like text messaging the patient to confirm appointments on their cell phone, being able to confirm that way. You know, how many times has that happened to one of us with our doctors? You know, very, very few times. Um, very, very rich, very easy to use and fully integrated application. We also have um, a very robust rules engine that helps to maximize the reimbursement in the medical practice. A full 30% of all claims that are, that are um, submitted by doctors to insurance companies today are denied, lost, or ignored the, on the first submission. So the rules engine helps to reduce that to about 10%. So, and, and of that 30% I mentioned, a full two thirds of that never gets fully uh, realized because of the inability of the practice to keep up with all this stuff, all these changing rules. So we maintain that rule system to help make sure that you know, we're moving through a much smarter process uh, in terms of dealing with the administrative side of the practice. And then we can also help um, the practice with back office services for payment processing, revenue collection, et cetera, that we offer as an optional service. Our technology, um, very, very, the first thing you'll notice is that you know, it's available, available on a myriad of devices. You know, doctors are mobile users, so they want to have mobile devices like the iPad, uh, the iPhone. We focus on design and usability, uh, making sure that you know, the system is very, very aesthetically pleasing, easy to use, and doesn't introduce any uh, unimportant steps in the, in the workflow of the practice. This is very different than the way most healthcare systems work. It's also fully web-based. So they can access it not only on uh, Internet Explorer on a PC, which is how all the other web-based systems do it, but they can also access it on a Mac uh, using any of the prevailing browsers. We, we wrote the system in open source to accelerate our time to market, and we've had a wonderful experience with, with open source technologies in doing this. And one of the things that, that you know, needs to be mentioned is that a system like this requires enterprise class capabilities. We can handle the most complex healthcare configurations that exist all the way down to solo practitioners, and we do that very, very well. 